Hi, we are 17 June in uh, France, in Alsace, at the place of Yannick van Doorne in the garden where there is a little test going on with a magnetic antenna and basalt and biochar. So here you see a broccoli plants and here you see the magnetic antenna that is just put on the soil of, of me. Uh, the, it's the magnetic antenna I invented in around 2010 already with connected to a wire and then you see here the cabbage plant so the wire is placed exactly south south to north orientation with a compass and here is the cabbage plant you see that this one is bigger and the further you go from the antenna from the wire the more little here you see the cabbage plant more little already at a uh, little bit more than 50 centimeters or one meter from the antenna so that's already a big difference and if you compare this cabbage plant with those ones so those are little bit little here it's an area with only basalt and here i put basalt and biochar in the soil and you see that close to the antenna it's even a lot bigger so Altogether, it works very well because it amplifies each other effects. But this one is a little bit higher than this one because uh, this one is like uh, with no influence of the antenna, so but with the biochar on top uh, with it. You see also the potatoes here in that zone is with biochar and with the antenna and basalt also here. It's only with the basalt and here it's without nothing. You see uh, here the control group is a lot more little. Huh? So it's a world, a big difference. You see that the cabbage plant are really a lot more little. So it's a huge difference with those ones that are already a lot bigger and the potato plants too compared to those ones. On the left is without anything here in the middle is with basalt and here it's with basalt biochar and the magnetic antenna so it's a, a lot bigger and there again it's only with basalt so very interesting so i just wanted to show you if we see in a big picture maybe we see it better you see here with the magnetic antenna, basalt and biochar, with uh, only basalt, and here without anything, <laughs> control group, a world difference. So, electroculture works very well. I show it to you since long time, and I'm very happy to see that now, uh, a little bit all over the world, people are experimenting electroculture. Thank you and share your results. You have my group on Facebook, Electroculture, Good Vibrations for Plants. And you have also Electroculture, Magnetoculture a page. And you have also my, my uh, Telegram groups uh, also and my internet site, electroculturevandoorne.com. Thank you. Bye-bye.